It's a Friday night spectacular, bro. Double whammy. Whoa! Whoa! Yeah, that's right. So, round eight, technically. Uh, it's Friday night again. It's only been like ten minutes since my other video, but guess what? I don't care. I got two good whis whiskey bourbons tonight. Bourbon whiskeys. I'm tearing it up. So this is Jim Beam Black. Extra aged bourbon. It doesn't say how long it's aged, but I don't care. I've already had this. It's pretty good. So it's like, uh, well, let me do some sipping here. A little background on this, by the way. So over the weekend, I was with the in-laws, my second family, and uh, on the top shelf at Grandma's, there was regular Jim Beam. And I haven't had regular Jim Beam in years and if at all and i was very impressed with it um being that i've tried all these other ones right so i saw this on the shelf jim beam black and i said well lord have mercy uh extra aged you best believe i'm gonna pick some of that up especially at 33 dollars for that thing right there that's a regular size. It kind of looks small in the video probably, but um, anyway, without further ado, I'm taking up too much of your time probably, so I um, already poured it. Let's, uh, let's do it up. Oh, yeah. All right, so this is, um, I would say, better than the regular Jim Beam. Definitely better than that shitty double oaked that I reviewed a while back. Um, sorry, Jim Beam, but double oaked, really? Shit was pathetic. This stuff, this is where it's at. I don't know how long you age this stuff, but um, it tastes like a six or seven year. and But it doesn't have a lot of flavor notes to it. But it has that six or seven year distinction. Maybe five, I don't know. Uh, obviously I'm not that much of a connoisseur, but, um, this stuff is impressive for 33, you know, $33. That's like mainstream cheap, but not like old crow cheap, but it's still good. So, um, you want a nice smooth matured, a matured age taste, then this is right up there with wild turkey 101. In fact, I'd say this is nice because it has that, uh, obviously the, uh, extra aged flavor profile to it. So, uh, if you're in the market for something cheap, but something good and something that has that aged, that extended age taste to it, this is where it's at. And oh my God, what is that? Oh, that's right. Some kind of trophy shit. World's highest rated bourbon well no shit it's pretty good right so yeah anyway this is my longest video yet oh well um yeah thanks for watching uh cheers on a friday night go tear it up but drink responsibly you know